piece and bust is just press composition. Okay. How do I start this video? I think I've been um not lacking fun, but I think I've you know it's plateauing almost like because one week I have all these like amazing occasions happen and the events and it was, it was perfect and then it gets to this week and it's just kind of like wow like what how do we get here you know, how do we get here at, at this point? And so it just occurred to me that I should not really feel bad about any of my faults or any of my mistakes. Along with, I should not be mad at, you know, things that didn't really happen. Like... The trip to the Bahamas really was, it wasn't really a fail, it just was, I knew it wasn't going to happen in April, because it's called money, <laughs> and when you need money the, for the fun stuff, you got to do, spend your money on the important stuff, um, so you can get to do the fun stuff, so yeah, that's what, that's what basically happened. Um, other than that, uh, the pain in my upper back, slope in my breast, it's been, I don't want to say radiating, but it's been taking turns, but it's now more like, not even a moderate, it's like a slight pain. And it's been a while since I said that, you know, because, um, I'm so, I was so used to being in, ex not excruciating, but almost moderate to severe pain. And I know that it's going to be kind of involved with not only my weight, but my depression. So what did I do? I basically took that pain and pushed through it and decided to just go through the rest of my day. I washed clothes between yesterday and today. Um, I'm prepping my outfits for when I go out, when I, like when I go out Wednesday to go see Miss Young. I'm literally just getting those clothes ready and not like being like my lazy not being lazy about it and just grabbing anything that I don't even want to wear to go see Michelle. I don't want to like do last minute outfits. So that that was that. And uh, I wore I don't I can't believe I did this, but I wore my waist trainer and my butt lifter out Wednesday. That doesn't really um, add on to my pain, to be exact, which is good, but I cannot believe I actually wore this out. Like, seriously, and excuse me, I'm watching cops. I don't watch cops in a minute, it's been a minute. But yeah, I wore my waist trainer, and I wore my butt lifter. Now, I didn't, I was like, the butt lifter ain't gonna do nothing for me. And all that, but the waist trainer did its job as usual, and it really sculpted. And I've been getting not really like, like off the top, over the top reactions. You know, you get the you know, the occasional honks every now and again, but the fact that I was able to 
walked outside and not shown off my trainer as if it was visible because it wasn't visible because the top I had on. Oh my god, oh this top. Awesome. The purple top that I had on, it was a dress and I cut it to turn it into a top and I wasn't going to do anything else to it because there was no point. But yeah, I did that. And I wear a top. And I and I felt good. I felt good about myself. I felt good about um, what I wore underneath. To the point where I was kind of entertaining myself in the mirror. And it was really good. It was very really good for me. And my mom started, you know, cleaning her room. Or what she called the dancing um, Thursday. And it... We had a time to reminisce on things. Um, I want you guys to take a look at this picture here. Take a real good look. Who do you see? Who do you see right there, giving out that smile <laughs> with that with them plaits? Lord have mercy. <laughs> That's me. That is me. I, I think that's maybe first. Maybe, maybe. I'm not sure. I don't remember kindergarten. But this is right around. I think right around maybe kindergarten. Because I didn't come to Edgewood. I didn't go to my um, Edgewood until maybe first grade. So, yeah. This was me at um, Robert. Robert. Mm, I forgot the whole one. Mm, I literally forgot the school I went to. Robert H. Uh, Robert Coleman. There you go. Robert H. Coleman Elementary School. That's when that picture was taken. This was back in. Doesn't really say this is the day. Yeah, this is this is a cold that picture. So you know this is old. But yeah. I don't know who those two. I hope. Do y'all see that? I don't know who those two guys are. I think they're probably grown up by now. And they probably, you know, not around in the area no more. But yeah, I t this was in my mom's tote, so I just snatched this, and you know, because I want to put it on my wall, because I love the fact that I could look at these pictures and be like, yeah, I used to smile. But then again, this was the Tanae, and that's my real name. This is the Tanae that um, you really couldn't see any, like, mental illness whatsoever. This is a Tanae that really didn't have that particular type of depression. I'm not sure if I missed this this one, you know, because I take a look around and I see the person that I am today, and then to come and look at this picture, I think the reason why I don't see this this girl anymore. It's probably she cut is because um, probably because uh, she grew up. She grew up and she saw the real world and how fucked up it can be with the political issues, the issues within our own. Not only our own generation, but within our own ethnicity and race. It's a lot of racial situations and people just beefing for no reason. And we're not uniting as we say we should for these many decades. Uh, you have to excuse me. Uh, bumps and shit. And uh, I'll do a story time on this. So this will be uh, video number three for maybe the vlog channel, but yeah.
I don't see that girl anymore because she grew up and she's still here surviving and trying to pursue her dreams even though this week wasn't off you know when it's the end of the month it is kind of it's kind of uh, stagnant so I don't want to be stagnant um, but unfortunately it comes to that so yeah um, me live streaming I don't know, man. I... That shit almost dropped down to at least a thousand frames. Now it's just mad. So I don't know about live streaming tonight. Um, cause regardless of how I feel about it, I don't know about live streaming tonight. But I will probably do. This is what I never done. I could never get the like the um. I, I, I could never get my gameplay situation right. Because the last time I live streamed, that shit was just trash. And the frames kept dropping. And I couldn't do what I wanted to do on there. So I just said, fuck it. Uh, like I said, I'm going to do a story time. Now, now I'm not blacking out, folks. But I'm going to do a story time on this. This happened yesterday. Yesterday or Thursday. Yes, sir. <laughs> this happened Wednesday. Sorry. This happened Wednesday. Yeah, I've been doing stupid shit. But other than that, peace and blessings. Happy Friday. I'm out.